How did you become a sports reporter? Well, it all started when I was four years old because I was told to my parents that I not, might not be able to play contact sports because I have a brain defect and a detached shoulder bone. But I made a deal with my parents that I would play three sports, football, basketball, and t-ball, all for one year. Once I was done with that, I wanted to hone my craft in journalism and broadcasting. So, it, and I kept asking my mom if I can make my own YouTube channel commenting on the Raiders, but she said no because they were in California at the time. <laughs> You know your stuff, sir. So when they moved back to Las Vegas, I had asked, I kept getting honor rolls in, in school and stuff, and then she let me make my YouTube channel in 2020. You deserve it. But I also have something else to say, because that's what started it, but what's really, what's really driving me is because I want to, like, make my parents proud at a young age because my mom, um, she um, has very much health issues, and my dad is a senior citizen. So, <laughs> so I want to make them proud at an early age because <laughs> most kids, they think that their parents are going to last forever for the rest of their childhood. But when I was five years old, my mom almost died. Mm. I had to um, t save my mom's life at the age of five years old because I knew that something was wrong with her. So I told my grandma to take her to the hospital. And like they said that if she wasn't there one minute later, she would have died. So. Mm. And for a month, I didn't see my mom because she was in ICU, and those were the worst 30 days of my life. But, That's so hard. But I, did, I talked, I had a long talk to God, and I told him, if you can bring my mom back, I will be the greatest son that I could ever be. Mm, make me cry. <laughs> Woo. Mm. Well, I, 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 I'm certain your mama is proud, because I'm proud. We're all proud of you. Thank you. You look, you look, you always look so nice and professional. And I see you have like this thing with a collection of, of ties. Um, yeah, it all started when I was two. It all started when I was two years old, where I wore a tie to my uncle's wedding. And I don't know, I always thought I would look good in the tie. So, <laughs> so when I got into journalism, and I always saw these people had like tuxedos with suits and stuff and the ties, I had said that I wanted to wear them. So my mom bought me this big tie collection, and <laughs> and uh, my favorite bow ties that I have are um, are called Designed by Dawn. Um, yeah, I like them very much. You do? Yeah. Well, we, we love you to be happy with what you like. So can we give you one? Because I got a little gift for you right here. Ooh. Ooh. Do you like it? Yeah. OK. And since you're a Raiders fan, I got a little something else for you. Can I give you another little something? Yeah. Oh, we got something good for you. The, the Raiders. There you go, son. This is for you. Jeremiah. Hold up, before we go. Oh, he, he said before we go, you go and tell him. I know that I'm a journalist, but can I step out of my lane a little bit? Sure, because yes, you can. I don't know if I'm ever gonna get this opportunity again. Can we sing a song together? Oh, baby, what oh. are we singing? Oh. Right. You want me to start? Uh, yes. You might want to stand up for this. Come okay, on. do I need to stand up? You might want to. Okay, I'm getting up. Right. Oh, he done called me out. Yeah. Jesus. Walk with me, Lord. Walk, Walk with me. me. You better sing. Walk, Walk with me, Lord. Sing, hey. Walk with me. <laughs> While I'm on this tedious journey, Lord. Sing it, son. I need Jesus. Jesus. To, to walk, walk with me. me. Should we tell everybody to yeah. Wait, okay. turn. Walk with me, Lord. Walk with me. While I'm on this tedious journey, Lord. I want Jesus to walk with me. We, we can't wait to see you continue to soar, young man. Keep Thank up you. the great work.